We posted our first video on this channel on December 4th of 2020, just a little over one year ago. Since then, we've had the chance to talk to Alex Rodriguez about her time in China, to Magdalene Selvain about her testimony and her book, to Lady Lee, a poet in Puerto Rico, and Leanne Goff about being a son and daughter of God. We were able to showcase our time at Marion Oaks Assembly of God and on missions trips to Puerto Rico. We highlighted ministries such as House of Hope and Teen Challenge and have had some candid conversations about dating, marriage expectations, and many other topics. Hello, my name is Dennis and I'm with One Love Ministries. Over this last year, I've just gained an appreciation for being consistent doing what God has called you to do, no matter what the situation may look like. Continuing on, um, despite what might look like a storm or a valley, keep working on because God blesses those times. And I know that I've been blessed through them. I look forward to 2022. I'm so grateful for everything God has given me and my family and realize how blessed I am to have a house, to have kids, to have a car. Um, there are so many people in the world without that. And with that, a few other members of our team want to share. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Hi, I'm Lisette, and I am with One Love Ministries. For this year, I must say that what I learned the most was the importance of family and community and living your life to the full. And for next year, not only am I expecting that, those things to continue to grow in my life, but also God's Word to grow even more and to flourish into my family, my community, and into One Love Ministries as our community of believers. I wish you all a Merry Christmas, a blessed and happy new year. Feliz Año Nuevo y Feliz Navidad. Hey, this is Greg and this is Lydia and we're the directors of One Love Ministries. We just wanted to take a minute and reflect on this year and share our hearts of what we're expecting for next year. So what about you? 2021 has been very challenging and this year in particular, I personally feel that the Lord has taken us past um, the step of confusion yeah. and now we, we have a direction that he is going to be with us no matter what. This pandemic has, we thought it was over and it just keeps continuing, but God has shown up each and every day. And, and this year is just filled with those promises and then I just can't wait for next year. My faith has increased. And so I'm just expecting for greater things next year and I'm just happy for what me personally, our marriage, and this ministry, what we're gonna do. How about you, babe? So I will tell you, even for, for me, this year has been really transformative. Uh, the word that I got at the beginning of last year, which we both had COVID last year on Christmas, through to New Year, so we celebrated with our family through iPads. Uh, but the word that I got was authentic, and it really challenged me to be myself, be authentic in my emotions, in my in my the way that I see myself. Um, and so this year was challenging in the sense that I realized there was a lot of areas I still wasn't really operating in authenticity, mm -hmm. especially here on YouTube. Uh, I want this channel to be our desire that is it's fun and that you guys get to see us and get to learn our personalities. Uh, but at the same time, we're really aware of the fact that we're not just representing Greg and Lydia, we're representing One Love. And so what I learned the most is that when you are just yourself and you're not concerned with pleasing man and your, your heart is really to please God, uh, there is something that happens in you. There's a confidence that comes out of that. And so I think that's been my greatest lesson of the year. And going into next year with that confidence, knowing that I am a daughter, that I'm not just a servant. I am a, I am a servant of God, but I'm... And I serve out of love and out of honor to my father. And so I'm excited for this year to really refine my listening, uh, just get creative and have fun in this. And we like to have fun. We laugh, we have a great time uh, together on our adventures, on the mission field, and the family. But I'm just so grateful for the year that we've had. We've had we have an amazing team. So. Thank you for following Adventures in One Love. Thank you for your prayers. We wish you a Merry Christmas. And a very, very blessed New Year. Mm -hmm. Remember, it starts with one. It starts with you. <laughs> I'm Greg. <laughs> and this is Lydia. And we're confused, obviously. <laughs>